Beardo Benjo. Today I'm going to be blasting all manner of strange alien creatures from dodos to spider-like monstrosities because I'm going to be playing Crashland. Now Crashland, if you haven't heard of it or don't have any prior knowledge, just sounds like or seems like another FPS action adventure horror game for the quest. Just another VR release coming out on a random Thursday. But Crashland, in fact, dates back to the very beginning of VR. Crashland predates the HTC Vive, the Oculus Rift, and most of the lovely fancy VR tech we have today. This game started its life as a tech demo, effectively, a demo or a proof of concept for VR way back when. This game is the granddaddy of FPS action shooters for VR, and it's making a fully fledged comeback or re-emergence or rebirth on the Quest platform. Taking all of that into consideration, today's release of Crashland is something of an event. It's great to see this game finally getting a full release on the Quest platform of all things, a great platform for it, and it has 24 levels, a fully fleshed out campaign with bizarre looking creatures, from terrifying spiders which will make me scream, to dodos and worm-like creatures that look like they were pulled straight from Dune. I'm genuinely excited to be jumping in and playing this today, I cannot wait to check it out. Come and join me. Check out some of this gameplay captured on the Quest 2. This game is available now on the Oculus Store. It's $14.99 UK currency, I think $19.99 dollars. Let's have a look if it's any good. I'm gonna scream if the spiders are anywhere near as terrifying as they look in the screenshots. I genuinely hate spiders. I'm gonna have a bad time. Righty then, welcome to Crashland. I'm currently floating in the middle of space. I should probably tell you a little bit about this game. You play as an astronaut who's continually crashing on different hostile alien planets and you need to fend off the aliens, fend off the life forms and survive there un until the end of the mission. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm down for that. I've put my NASA jumper on today because I want to kind of channel that astronaut vibe. Okay, this is the options menu. We've got a couple of um, little kind of comfort settings here. I'm going to change rotation to smooth. My visual tunneling off, that's where you kind of get the vignette around the screen, the sides. It helps if you get motion sickness, but I, I don't want that. And stick locomotion is on. I'm standing. Yeah, I'm pretty good. I'm on normal mode. Let's, let's do this. Okay, perks. Oh my god. Perk system. Kill enemies in crash land to gain XP and level up. Each level unlocks a new perk. Perks give you new abilities and modify how the game plays. At higher difficulty levels, you can select multiple perks at once. Turret perk unlocked at level 5. Okay, so I can unlock funky new things. Oh my god, look at all these perks. Okay. So, right? That's brilliant. Level 2, level 3. Right, a total of 30 perks there to unlock. Extra speed, I can punch things, I, I, can, I can assume. Okay, there's a lot of cool stuff to unlock and work towards there. I'm on level 1, so I have Overkill, which is a 30% XP boost from... 30% XP from boosted kills. Press A for perk details. Killing hostiles with a boosted pistol shot awards an extra 30% XP, that's cool. This perk is useful for faster leveling and high score strategies. Right, so if I have that on, I should level up quicker. Right. Mission select. Welcome Pilgrim. I'm not a pilgrim, that's rude. Crash land on this planet and survive until rescue. You will do this repeatedly. Master the pistol, boomstick, scanner and teleporter to survive. Each mission brings new environments. There's a spider. I saw that. Disgusting. Uh, new environments, weapons and hostiles. You are a gladiator. This is your arena. Crash land and be reborn. Very excited. Okay, basic training. I'm going in. Level zero. Uh, complete training. Yep, straightforward stuff. Oh! I guess I'm gonna crash. That's me in that spaceship, being a terrible astronaut. Oh! This looks very simple, but very cool. The, the distance, kind of the depth, is really nice. I don't have a body, which is strange. Welcome to training. Press A to continue. Uh, use the left analog stick to walk. Simple. Very simple. Uh, use the right analog stick to turn. 
Oh, it's still on snap. I changed it to smooth, you madman. I'll change that again in a minute. Uh, pull back on the right stick to turn around. Okay, I can do a quick spin. That's very nice if enemies are behind me. That's a nice quick way to get round to the back. Push up on the right stick to teleport. Simple. Yeah, I like that. I like that very much. Okay, teleport's remaining. One. Okay, I had to teach the game or show the game I knew what I was doing. Uh, you have a limited number of teleports. Oh! Okay, I guess you could kind of cheese your way out of situations by just teleporting away, so that's why they're limited. Interesting. That's an interesting mechanic. Okay. Teleport will slowly recharge. How do I know when it's recharged? Killing hostiles will also recharge the teleporter. This is your smart pistol. Well, that is a smart looking pistol. I've got hand now, just one hand. Destroy the targets. Okay. I did it. Your teleporter is now recharged. These are boost balls. What the? Okay, boost balls. Boost balls drop from dead hostiles. Hey, look, there's another person. Crash! Crash! Now nah, they're a way better pilot than me. Uh, okay, so I go and pick one of these up. Squeeze the pistol grip to boost damage. Oh, it's like glowing red now. Okay, right, so I can do like a kind of an overcharge on my weapons. Very cool. Boost balls also explode when shot. Yeah, they do. Very nice. And I guess this is the energy gauge here, the red line. This is a boomstick. Whoa! It is currently set to plasma grenades. The boomstick recharges between shots. Destroy the targets. Oh! <laughs> okay. Uh... All right. Okay, so that's like it. Right. This is kind of like a... Can I actually get a shot? Too high. Oh, too high! Right, that's going to take me a minute to master that. The boomstick has a built-in motion scanner. Squeeze the, the boomstick grip to activate the scanner. Oh, so I know where there's enemies. Oh, I, this is cool! Um, the scanner detects hostiles nearby. Yep. It also detects boost balls and power ups. Power up mortar. God, that was loud. A power up mortar is landing nearby. Can I have that? Burst fire. Oh, burst fire. Power ups unlocked. Unlock new pistol and boomstick modes. Okay. Cycle fire modes by pressing A. Precision fire. Burst fire. Precision fire. Burst fire. Burst fire. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is cool. This is very cool. Okay. Basic training complete. I did it. I bloody did it. Okay, it's quite a lot to take into account here. Um, right, we're going to mission one now, right? Surely. First contact. Okay, so mission one. It's three minutes long. Got to survive four, I assume. I've got my precision fire handgun and my plasma grenade. We've got ticks. We've got insectoids. And we've got shock slugs. I don't know what that is, but he's got a toothy grin and I'm going to shoot it off his face. Alright, there's my crash vehicle. Distress signal. Salvation in three minutes. Stand right, there's, by. there's something coming. Oh my god, there it is. What is that? Oh. oh no, get off me! What are you doing? Oh, okay. Right, no, no, you're not. No. Where's that crab thing? Oh, I don't like these. Right. What's. Oh! Oh, those crabs are horrible. 
Right, you've really got to go for it with them. Are you? Stay back, you little bugger. It's like, like aliens. Um, I've got my motion tracker. I know where they're coming from. Come on. Ah! Bloody hell, they take such a beating. There's a boost ball there. I could kind of... What is that? What are you? Oh, no. Bugger. Oh, no, bugger. I'm not feeling well. Alright, kill that stupid slug. Oh, it's these crabs that absolutely do me in. Right, I've got to use my boosted fire now. That's it, that's it. Come on. Oh, that makes things so much easier. Use your boosted fire. Oh my god, they take such a beating. No! Stay away! Oh, it's going to be horrible when the spiders come. Some Three minutes of this. 60 seconds. 60 seconds. Ah, I can survive 60 seconds. Boost ball. Yes! I've got a boost ball. Weird slugs come in again. Very nice. Saint behind me. I love... Ooh, you little cheeky devil! I really like how fast you can shoot. If you spam that trigger, you can really go for it. Yes, boost ball. Where are they? Where are they? Hello. One behind me. Somewhere. Is he still alive? Oh, slug boy's it. Salvation. <laughs> Get lost crab! Mr. Crab over here, give me some grief. I'm being beamed up. You can still have a go though. Hell yes! Mission two, straight into the spiders. Oh, for God's sake. Okay, I'm, I'm nearly leveled up, though. This this is a great new contender for, like, arcade game you can just jump into and have a quick blast on Quest. There's loads of them, because the Quest platform's built primarily for that kind of pick-up-and-play VR experience. But this is immediately accessible. Just chuck it on, shoot some crazy creatures. This, this is going to be popular. I have a feeling this is going to be very, very popular. Okay, so I've got... Precision, fire. I didn't use any of my plasma grenades. Uh, plasma grenades, chopper. What's a chopper? Ticks, hoppers, spiders, long legs. That all sounds horrible. That all sounds disgusting. I don't want to go to this planet. Don't go there. Fly off. Oh, and it's kind of raining. Oh, here they come. Here they come. Oh, look at that! Look at that! Oh, they take an absolute beating as well. Oh, I'm going to get absolutely mullered here. What's that? Oh! Weird little baby ones. Oh, God. Hello, hello. Where are they? No. Stay back. Stay back, demon spawn. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm keep, keeping my eye. I leveled up! Heck yes! Stay away, crab. I'm trying to keep an eye on, like, behind me. Right, I need a boost ball. Come here, boost ball. Oh, I don't like them! Oh, that's nightmare fuel. Absolute nightmare fuel. Oh, I'm not doing alright. Stay back. Christ. Right. Oh, they're everywhere. They're everywhere. Game over, man. Game over. Come on. Come on, boost ball me. Give me some boost balls. Ah. Right. 
Right, got me boost balls. Oh god, they're everywhere. Then, oh, they're not too bad. These jumpy ones. It's the big spiders I don't like. And that. Whew. All right, we're doing okay. There's a boost ball there. I'll have that. Thank you very much. How long have I got to survive in this one? I cannot remember. What's that? Kill it! Kill it! Kill it! I don't like it! Oh, crap. I died. Can I stop? It's getting hairy again. Loads of stuff comes in the last 60 seconds. It gets pretty intense. Bugger. Take that. Come on. Oh, God. Come on, I'm so close. 12 seconds. Salvation. No. Come on. Come on, please. 12 seconds. Come on, go. No seconds. Come on. Come on. Get me out of here. Get me out of Spider Planet. Please. Please. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God I'm leaving Spider Planet. Thank God I finally did level two. It took me four attempts. Four attempts to do level two. This game has infinite replayability because you'll never get off of level two. Oh, my word. Oh, now I finally see the giant worms. Okay, I've made it to level four. Um, as in my XP is level four. I'm actually only on level three. And I've been playing for probably coming up to an hour now. I've unlocked a, a four perks. So I've got Executioner, which is 15% of max boost on Boomstick Kill, 25% Boomstick Recharge. I still like Bully. 25% boosted pistol damage because he, the pistol is basically your primary weapon. Let's jump into this one uh, and I'll sum up whether I think you should buy this game. I'm already going to tell you now. Yeah, you should buy this game. This game is great. But I think it's going to be... Seven minutes. Worm. Seven minutes? Seven okay. Five. You've got to last longer and longer. Oh, these guys are back. Yeah, they're rubbish now. What is that? Oh my god. It's like a flying bladder. Don't like the flying bladders. That's that's not, not great. Is that a bomb? Yeah, that's a bomb. Come on now. Go away. Behind me, behind me, behind me. I was going to sum up while I was playing, but it's really difficult. It's very engrossing. Ooh. Holy hell. I just want to see a giant worm. Tons of tons of these smiley little green buggers. Oh, these guys are still here as well. No. No, thank you. Alright, what's that? Ooh, what we got, what we got, what we got? Yes, thank you very much. Burst fire sounds perfect right now. Yeah, love that, love that, love that. Stay back. I can probably fire faster than burst fire. Just on my own, normally. Oh, here they are, sandworms. Oh my word! Christ! Look at that big fleshy monstrosity! Alright, you know what? 
I am relaxed enough to sum up now. Crashland started off as a demo back in the dawn of VR. And I'm so glad it's come back as a fully fledged product for the quest. This is so fun. It's... Bloody hell! <laughs> it's so much more fun than I anticipated it would be. It seems like it's going to have a huge amount of replayability. There's 24 levels to get through, tons of perks to unlock. And the levels are difficult as well, so you're probably not going to do all of them on the first attempt. I mean, this level I've got to survive for seven minutes, and I'm three... I'm halfway through. The creatures are genuinely disgusting, and I can't wait to see how much more ridiculous they get. The spiders are particularly nasty, but I'm sure there will be other horrific things as the levels progress. As I say, this is only level three. Oh my god, this is so intense. Ooh. This is also another game that will work really well with a big play space that you can actually move around in. I say right now I'm playing static, obviously. Oh no, no, no. But this would work so well if you played room scale and were able to move around a bit more because obviously I'm not moving a huge amount for the purposes of the video so oh, it's, it's great it's simplistic the visuals yeah the visuals are quite simplistic but they save up all the juicy stuff for the enemies which are horrible great gore kind of they fall and ragdoll all over the place each time you play it's not the same enemies spawning at the same time as well so there's elements of replayability there the guns sound great it's just juicy brutal Action arcade shooting. And I love it. Um, I'm going to sink a lot of time into this. Crap. Ooh! Big Daddy Crap Boy! Yeah, I'm going to sink a lot of time into this. I think this is a, a, this is a great time. $14.99 on the UK store. I'll definitely get 15 quid's worth of value out of this product. Um, it will be another staple of my quest library, which is where I can have friends over when we're allowed friends over again and uh, chuck them into this oh, oh bugger off I'm not going to survive this minute 20 left. Things about to get crazy. Chopper. Chopper, hell yeah. Ooh. Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! Salvation in 60 seconds. 60 seconds, come on. Oh, I hate these big flying spleens. Come on. I can do this. I can survive. I can survive Crab Planet. Crabby Worm Planet. Oh, no. No, nope, I can't. Gonna die. Gonna die. Gonna die. Something out there. Oh my god, there's so many of these. Oh no. It's getting very intense now. There's a Oh my god, oh my god. And then I got eaten. What a great way to end the video. I got eaten by the bloody stupid dune worm. Crashland. I don't have much more to say. Um, go and check it out. Incredibly intense arcade shooting it feels brutal it feels gratifying loads of replayability i've been playing for about an hour and i've done that much and there's all these other levels to explore the visuals are quite simple in the landscapes but i'm sure it will change up as you go through the detail is really in the creatures you're fighting they look disgusting and i love the way they ragdoll all over the place plenty of levels to go up perks to unlock levels to explore creatures to explode 
For £15, this is well worth it. Crashland. It's here. It's out now. Go check it out. I hope you've enjoyed, guys. I'll see you soon for another one. Take care of yourselves. I'm going to shoot some more of these disgusting things. I need to find out what else there is. I know there's like dodos on one of these levels, which just feels kind of mean, but I, yeah, I want to get there. Take care.